motion capture is just the body, um, you know, like the head position, but it's not the, the facial, not the performance. So all the stuff that we're shooting on performance capture is all the performance in Squadron 42. So the dramatic scenes, you know, people's dialogue, and so we capture their motions and um, you know, what they're saying and what's happening on their face to map it all onto their sort of di digital alter egos inside the, the world of Squadron 42. And we'll be doing that here in the Imaginarium stage uh, at Ealing Studios uh, for the next three months. My name is Ian Duncan and I'm, uh, I'm playing the player. So everything's from uh, my point of view and all the interactions that every character has, it's, um, it's with, my, with my character kind of cool and different. Um, I'm looking forward to the challenge. I'm getting my markers on my head and my body. No, I'm getting markers on my body and a camera on my head. Yes. So we wear the cameras and the headgear so it captures the performance. Regular every day at work. We've got this helmet on our heads that actually films every little close-up. I mean, you can't really get much closer than this. It's going to pick up every single feature of ours. All those other many, many cameras and gizmos capture the, the physicality. I don't know, 50, 60 or so cameras, I'm just picking up a number there. I did mocap last time five years ago and it's already evolved. I think I look pretty <laughs> sexy. <laughs> and that's why I'm here. I think, oh, thanks, scan down, just to check. <laughs> that's the money shot. Because <laughs> everyone looks very odd. <laughs> Wearing, like, you know, all in one very uh, suits that don't leave much to the imagination. You feel very self conscious, but the, uh, the trick is obviously to lose that self consciousness and just kind of be yourself within the space and play the character within the space. A bit like being in a theatre workshop. It's all in your mind. Home to the famous Squadron 42. Yeah, it's like make-believe. Yeah, it's like being five again. Yeah, it's like being five again. <laughs> Whoa! Mental, physical training's been pretty intense. Um, I sat and had a cup of tea this morning and then came here. <laughs> so you have to go through a series of 90 plus expressions ranging from frowning, smiling, looking up, looking down, left, right. And uh, the combination of all those things mean that they can then control the way that you look digitally. First time you do it, it, it can feel very weird. It's quite a test. I love it. I, I feel very at home here. From what I gather, Chris is a bit of the sort of George Lucas of this stuff. Really putting you in the game in a way that we don't have right now. Where you have uh, emotional connections with characters. The old days when I did Wing Commander, I felt like we sort of advanced uh, sort of cinematic storytelling in games back there. Uh, and I think you know our cast is something that you would even have you would have in a movie, definitely, um, in a way that you don't normally see in games, which is pretty cool. Cal, he's kind of the charming, famous one. What took you guys so long? You almost missed all the fun. I want you to hear this. Sit down. We had Liam Cunningham this morning, uh, who's playing Captain White. I think Bishop's going to be a great character. Uh, Gary's awesome to work with, and you know he's bringing a lot of nuances to it. Some of you may ask him why I undertake such a thing. I can tell you in one word. Victory! Can you better be on your way? A little bit starstruck. <laughs> it's like an extra level of nerdy geek out. EVA back to your ship. Luke Skywalker. <laughs> Yeah, we were going through a list of actresses that we thought uh, would be believable as Gary's daughter. Jillian was my top choice. <laughs> we'll handle it exactly the way you did on the X-Files. She's great. She's tough. She's awesome. Um, she definitely holds her own. We got Harry Treadaway, who's amazing. I think we're getting drunk before we even start work, so it's a good day at work. Oh, this is our uh, space whiskey. It's uh, 5,000 year old. Yeah, single malt. <laughs> just been a really joyous experience. Yeah, I mean, working with all the, the A-listers was just amazing. The fact that uh, I got to be in every single scene was, was a real, real honor. Cast and Chris have done an unbelievably great job. It's going to kick other games in the ass. The message to fans would be that thank you for enabling us to do something at this level. Uh, what we shot here was way, 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 way beyond what initially I thought I would be able to do. So I know it's hard to wait, but tr trust me, it'll be something that uh, I think you'll be glad that you support it. Thank you so much, guys. Uh, it's been a pleasure. I'm pretty excited to see it sort of come alive. It's going to be a cracker. Yeah.